Hello, my name is Joe Rodriguez and I would like to explain how, how would I use 48 cores from AMD, uh, magnet cores uh, kind. Uh, I work for, for a web service that solves linear systems of equations like this. Here. Uh, where you have uh, a matrix, a column vector, another column vector that uh, in these systems you have more unknowns than data, then you try to solve the inverse problem uh, to, to find a solution, a column vector. Uh, each solution will give you a graphic like this and uh, what we are trying to do is to try to find the most graphics per second, the more frames per second. Um, such problems arise in geophysical uh, uh, prospecting areas and uh, what I'm going to show you right now is how we use these uh, uh, four core opterons to do the task and then uh, what would we would like to, to have is to, to solve these problems for um, other areas re uh, than geophysical prospecting, like um, medical tomography, uh, but with more with more more cores. So I'm going to show you a program that solves a linear system that, that I just show you. Um, Okay, so what we have here is a computer running with four cores. We are going to uh, run the program. Sorry. Here. And what we have right now is a uh, neural network based solution that solves a, a, the problem I just described to you, where we have actually. Uh, the four cores running in order to solve for the linear system of equations and, and what we have is a uh, diminishing of uh, least squares error or is called an RMS and uh, we just solve what is it is a uh, uh, 730 floating point numbers by 2520 uh, floating point numbers linear system in which we have more unknowns than data and uh, that that in terms would give you gave us uh, as I mentioned before a graphic like this one here which represents represents the uh, uh, the uh, properties in this case of the subsoil this is uh, uh, 60 kilometers of uh, depth uh, the surface and then uh, this could well represent uh, a geothermal activity uh, which could be used for for uh, uh, green energy uh, production but this is not all we can use this system uh, for for like I mentioned before for uh, medical tomography so uh, that's it. Uh, what we would like to have is to improve our uh, speed and to let me run, run this again and to have uh, this linear system of, of equations being solved as fast as, as, as possible. Uh, our final goal will be to have 30 frames per second. Uh, right now we are having like uh, uh, as you can see, four cores running um, with 10,000 neurons. It takes about half half a minute. Uh, well, that's 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 it. Uh, uh, I would like to thank uh, AMD for the opportunity to. Um, for this contest to have 48 cores. Uh, thank you very much.